How fast will the stimulus money get here and what can it be used for? Those are two of the big questions that people want to know. Our newsroom receives calls every day from people wanting to know when will they get their check. We hear most often from one group in particular, people on disability wanting to know when they're going to get their check. Can you shed any light on that for them? Yes. Uh, if they haven't yet received it, they're sending out checks every single day or, you know, direct deposit. So over the coming weeks, everyone should be getting their checks. We pose questions to the Commerce Secretary from elected leaders in our state. North Carolina Treasurer Dale Falwell has talked for years about the hundreds of millions in health care liabilities that North Carolina cities and counties have. He wants to know, can this money be used to take care of that long debt? It is an excellent question, and the answer is yes. The, the purpose of the package was to provide enough relief to every community in America, but to let the communities have the flexibility to figure out what their needs were. Burlington Mayor Ian Baltutis wants to know about fixing his community's broadband problem. It's not just low-income families who struggle to get online. State Senator Amy Gailey, who lives in the county, says she too has trouble getting a decent signal at her home. The mayor's question, we want to know if the stimulus can be used to make critical investments in building that infrastructure to allow our economy to become more resilient to future pandemics and economic challenges. Yes, absolutely. And that does seem like a very wise investment to me. In fact, one of my priorities as Commerce Secretary uh, is to make sure um, that every American has access to broadband. President Biden is very committed to that goal. The Republicans have objected to this plan. They say that it's overkill, that it's just wasteful spending. It's too big a bill. And I'm wondering, what is your response to that? Uh, it is what is necessary to meet the needs of the American people. Uh, and you mentioned I was a former governor. I saw it every day in my home state. People are struggling. The Commerce Secretary says that President Biden heard the call for help from the American people and delivered it. By the way, she says small business owners can get some help as well. She urges you to reach out to the Small Business Administration, SBA.gov. She says there's money there that is grant money, not loans. In Greensboro, I'm Bill O'Neill, WXII 12 News.